Hey guys, and welcome back to more The Suffering. When we last left off, uh, we pretty much got body bagged by a humongous uh, battle up this way, I do believe. Now, I've been trying to think for a little while what this game reminds me of, and it suddenly clicked. This game just reminds me of Serious Sam, actually, and just like how silly and wacky it is. Um, definitely, like... Uh, I'm getting zero horror vibes from this game, like whatsoever. I don't know whether that's just me or what, it just seems like a, I don't know, just like a cartoony kind of shooter really, <laughs> I don't know how else to say it. Um, very little horror elements to it, but maybe I'm just desensitised, I'm not sure. Anyway. Let's just keep working over these guys. And I really, really not a fan of these guys. They just waste so much of your time. Um, just chow down some pills. There we go. Yeah, as, as a rule, I'm not a fan of these sort of enemies where you have to wait for them to do their their thing, tick their box before they come out and attack you. The uh, rest of the enemies are fun, though. I like them. Uh, definitely some of my uh, favorite enemy designs in this game. Now, I want to try something a little bit different here. Yeah, I'm not really sure uh, exactly what's going on there. Whether they're executing prisoners of war or what. But you know what? Let's just grab some... Uh, Heavy firepower here. Should make this bit a little bit uh, less clumbersome. Oh, okay. So you actually can hit all of these guys with this machine gun. Alright. So I'd give it a go. That is until the enemies start like spawning behind us, which maybe that's a thing. Oh. Wait a minute. Oh, right. Okay. So once you're on this gun you can turn it all the way around. But only once you're on it. That's kind of good to know, I guess. And man, see what I mean? It's like, <laughs> this isn't a horror, really. It's just, <laughs> it's just funny craziness. But that's okay. We like a little bit of silliness. I mean, we play Resident Evil after all. All right. We good? There we go. Easy as that. Yeah, I don't know if these guys were prisoners or what, you know. I guess they were. They weren't just, you know, soldiers stationed on this island. Um, that were, I don't know, insubordinate or something. Not really sure. But anyway, let us continue our nice little stroll. What the fuck? Uh, hey dude. Can we chill? Fucking pigs. Yeah, dude, can you stop throwing TNT at me? Everything's cool. Alright. Single bullet theory. <clears throat> I'm guessing those uh, loading screens are actually giving us some backstory and stuff. Trouble is, the Xbox loads this so fast, you can't read them, which is kind of redundant. I think if you're going to, you know, add loads of story uh, via a loading screen, you should, you know, and the system loads it too quick to actually read them. You know, the obvious answer is to have like a, a button prompt to move them on. You know, but hey, you know, what do I know? I'm just, you know, a jackass that sits uh, in front of a microphone for uh, roughly, I don't know, five to eight hours a week. Uh, and talks endless quantities of shit. So there's that, I guess. What do we got over here? Ooh, oh, nice. Don't mind if I do. Alright, looks like we've got some options. So this leads. You're so violent. 
You're so violent. Well, thank you, I guess. Oh. Oh, lovely. Thank you. Some pills. We like pills. Pills and shotgun shells. Curious as to why there's like two packets of shotgun shells here. Yeah, we can only hold uh, one packet of those, really. But I guess there's some, some more to go back to. Alright. Yeah, and those um, like flashes, those, those uh, jump scares. Ooh. Oh. Is that in front or behind? Hey, dude. Whoop. Ah, that's a flashbang. That ain't really going to help us out at all, is it? Whoop. Got some nades. Whoop. I like the way you see the pin come flying off. It's kind of cool. Alright. Pretty sure they're not really doing much for us. Might need TNT. Alright, what about now? Okay. Uh, right, so possibly either three grenades or we just need to throw them at them when we're topside or when we're not underwater. Could be the ticket. <laughs> yeah, absolutely overdoing that. Um, those jump scare images to the point where they just become comical. Especially when they just flash the same like two or three images over and over and over again. You know, maybe if it happened like, you know, five or six times, oh, hello, throughout the game. Yeah, it probably would have been a little bit more impactful, but get out of here. Ooh. You know what? He's pretty resistant to the shotgun. Yeah, constantly throwing them up all the time. Just a bit silly, really. You coming? You coming down? Alright, we're good. We good. Step to your grave, motherfucker. Oi! Oi! That's quite enough of that. Look, I don't want to have to strap this shotgun to your asshole. But I will, friend. Ooh, nice. I like the way they're called shrapnel grenades. They're so weird. I mean, you know, sure. Technically accurate, but just an odd... Oh. Dude. I'm not a pig. Do I have to blow this up? Uh, pass. Is he dead? Right, what are we missing here? He's dead. What are we missing here? So we can't get th through there. Unless... Do we have to use like TNT or some shit? It doesn't make sense because you might not have TNT here. No. No. TNT is not effect. Ah! Aha! <sighs> Super jump up there. Hmm. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, you little. Look, dude. Honestly. You just. You're going the right way to get yourself blown to pieces. And I feel I am more than qualified to dispense such justice. Chunked you. Didn't even give you the satisfaction of bleeding to death. Um, Alright, this is a, a little bit cryptic. A little bit mazy, but that's alright. We don't mind that. Oh, checkpoint. We can handle a checkpoint. Or ten. Okay, they're going to go fight each other. Go there, lads. Whoop. Oh. 
That's what we call a grenade. That does have a pretty satisfying pop to it. And they really like giving us shotgun shells. And all the time they're going to give us shotgun shells. I'm going to keep taking them. Corey liked the fire too much. He took Malcolm with him. They're with us now. All right. Word is bond. I'll fuck you up. Whoa. You're a penis. Honestly. I hope you die, like, really horribly. Like, you get your asshole eaten by rats. I would seriously support that. Ooh, Warfort. We're gonna get, like, a cool new weapon. Although, I can't really see what else we're gonna get given, to be honest. We have pretty much everything we need. Yep. Alright, let's have a little look at this war fort. It's not going to be there, is it? There we go. World War II fort. Built in 1942, Fort Malison served as both coastal defense facility and POW camp. Mm -hmm. The fort had some 250 men and held approximately 1,000 prisoners. The fort's most notorious story is of its colonel, who executed three of his men for treason because a German airplane crashed on the island. A subsequent court-martial found no evidence to justify these executions, and the colonel ended up taking his own life. Right. So that's what we saw then. Colonel who executed three of his men for treason. Right, hang on. So, 250 men on here, 1,000 prisoners. Um, why did he execute three of his men for treason? Because a German airplane crashed on the island. Is it their fault the German airplane crashed on the island? I guess that's why the court martial found no reason to justify the executions. He was just a little bit fucked up. But he's dead now, so that's okay. This is the enemy. All right. Sure it is. Evening. What is this shit? Your quest for the court martial. God damn it, old man. Those fuckers will never get me. Hmm. So there's our colonel. Seems to have a bit of a bad time. Yeah, okay, that was a really long, annoying flashback glitchy thing. Fine. Definitely wanted that TNT. Large map of the world. Alright. Lots of telephones, including the red phone. Thanks for the can you throw away. Ah. Huh. Can? Did they have cans of uh, drinks and things back in 1940s? I mean, they had canned food, canned meats and things, but canned drinks? I don't know. Certainly possible. Would have thought most drinks would have been in glass bottles. Yeah, dude, look, it's pretty freaking obvious that we're not a cop. Alright, I'm just saying... Or a guard, I guess. We're running around in the same old shit that you're dressed in. Ooh. I wonder. Alright, they're not volatile. Probably for the best. Ooh, that's volatile, though. Ooh. 
smoked his ass. Okay. Yep. I mean, makes sense. Oh, boy. Here we go. Here we go. Alright. Let's turn up the diarrhea dial. You can piss off. Honestly. Now, who the hell do you think you are? Now, we've definitely angered the locals here. Oh, my. That's fine. We shall stack the bodies. We shall use the bodies as sandbags. So many sandbags. So many sandbags. I think we've got one of those little needle pushers running around somewhere. Sticking needles in my ass. Jolly rude of the fella, to be honest. Hello. You can fuck off. Yeah, plenty of bullets. Who would have thought this uh, half decade old machine gun would be in such perfect working order? I guess we should be thankful. Why not? Hello. Oh, you are ugly. In your breath, mate. Not great, I'm going to be honest. How we doing? We good? Yep, ah, there's always more. Okay, now we just got to go through the motions of killing all these guys. We done? Are we done? I think we're done. Ah. Uh, yeah, okay, well, we've pacified the area. Sanitized, if you will. I guess we're going that way. Or are we? Yep, that's the only way to go. Look at these things. Ugly bastards. I wonder what they had on their head. It was uh, it's a bandana. Which, you know, makes sense. Considering what they're, you know, based around. Dude. Maybe... Have you done goofed? You don't goof. <laughs> no. No. Probably shouldn't have, dude. You done fucked up now, friend. Hey, you. You gotta get me out of here. Fucker tried to kill you. He did. Of course he'll... You gotta blow this wall without killing me. All right, well, whoa, okay. Shit, I think I hear something coming. Look, dude, just stand back, all right? There's going to be a lot of TNT flying around. Because I don't know how I'm supposed to. I'm not a guard. You can obviously see that. Shit, I think I hear something coming. How do I... How do I blow the wall? Look, I'm sorry for trying to blow your ass up. Now get me out of here. Yeah, look, I'm trying, man. I'm honestly, genuinely trying. But I'm also not you were a guard, man. convinced that it's possible. Um. You gotta blow this wall without killing me. Yeah. I know. Oh, that hurt. Shit. I think I hear something coming. How the fuck do I get you out? You would have thought that it's pretty obvious. I'm sorry for trying to blow your ass up. Now get me out of here. I'm trying, dude. So you would have thought that you either have to blow this mess up. I'm sorry for trying to blow your ass up. Or you have to blow this mess up. 
Hey you! You gotta get me out of here! But is it that? Yep. Oh. What? What? Thanks, man. I would have gotten out of there myself, but you just sped the shit up. It's sorry about trying to blow you up back there, but I thought you were a hack. I've been in Abbott too long, damn it. Look, I ain't going back. You feel me? Yeah, all right, dude. We gotta get to the lighthouse. We do. Right up here. All right, dude. Come on. All right, you just be careful where you're throwing those uh, those explosives. I would load that so we get our TNT back, but I've honestly no idea how I blew the wall up, you to with be me, honest. Dog? Uh, yes, dog, I'm with you, all right? Now, who's this fellow? Uh, right up here. Come on. Yeah, cool, but what's this way? Apart from enemies, large quantities of enemies. If we come back here, dude, we might be able to get some of our ammo back. Or at least some of our explosives. Ah, fuck you. You can fuck off and all. Good lord. Right, you're done. Okay, one at a time. Ow, you penis. Honestly, it's the thanks I get for trying to release your souls. You know, maybe. Ooh. What's this gonzo gun like? What? 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 What the fuck? It's like a one-hit super kill weapon. Who saw that coming? Probably everybody. Here's me thinking it was some kind of joke weapon. Also, notice how we've never managed to get more ammo for that gun yet. Ow! Some of these guys look like they've got armoured heads. Not a fan of that, to be honest. I'm hoping my friend, Mr. Boom, hasn't got himself killed somehow. But then, I guess if he gets himself killed, not really my problem, is it? In all fairness. Alright, come on. Yep. That's what you get. That's what you get. Jesus. Right, so... I guess we get flashbang grenade. Really? That's it for coming up here? Alright. Definitely not worth it. But, you know, we would have spent our whole lives wondering what would have been just on over yonder. Whereas now we know. I could have been sitting... Dog? Yes, dog, I'm with you. It's this way. Alright. My name's Clock's ticking. Talk, the lighthouse has not a basement. dog. Like a Look, we can hold up there and wait until the dope wears off and these hacks are out of ammo. Look, it's tight up in these caverns, but I know all the shortcuts. Tight, you say? Well, let's we'll take the machine gun then. I'm glad you know all the shortcuts. I'm glad. Makes my evil black heart happy. After you, dog. Hallucinations. That's what's going on here. Hacks, dope the food. Now we are tripping, seeing shit. <laughs> just killing us for sport. <laughs> Fucking police. Uh, I mean, it's an interesting theory. You know? Fuck the world. Well, yeah. We've all said that a few times. Especially during our younger yeah. years. Right, you just be careful where you're throwing those explosives, dog. Alright, there we go. Uh-huh. Oh, hello. Whoa, Jesus. Almost had my nutsack. It's right up here. Come on. Yeah, I like the way he's just running around with a lit TNT. 
Yeah, all right. Cool story, bro. Are you with me, dog? Yeah. <sighs> Not if you keep calling me dog. It's right up here. Come on. Well, I'm glad you know where you're going. Admittedly. We have to wait in here. As long Clock's as it ticking. takes. Those girls gonna find us? I don't think so. Are we gonna Is have this a way? There's plenty of ventilation. Calm down. What about the food? Right up here? Oh, oh. No, I think we should... Yeah? When we run out of food, you're gonna be the first one we eat. Uh. The hold up. Trying to get some story, dude. Alright. It's this way. It's very, very, very fucking tempting to it's shoot right you. Up here. It really is. In fact, it's using all of my mental fortitude. What's Every ounce of mental focus to not shoot you, dog. Alright. Honestly. Is it too much to use the queens, mate? Ooh. Right. Finally, you are here. You interest me. Because you understand how it feels. They needed someone professional to pull the switch. A lot of eager sadists applied, but I was the only one who took the work seriously. So seriously, I wanted to taste the gas myself. That's what Connor does. It brings out the killer inside. It's the perfect place for you and me. Yeah, pretty rough way to go. There's a difference between those that feel safest in the light and those that feel safest in the dark. Oh, this is bad. Which are you, Tork? Ah, uh, I guess we're gonna find out. In the chamber, there is an intense light. Right, I don't know what that's doing. Is this a boss fight? No one knows you. I guess this is a boss fight. I like that feeling. Do you know? Ah. Right. Oh! Got ya. That's a switch. Not really sure what that's doing. Yeah, buddy, it's all a it's all a rich tapestry. I love the history on Carnate. Uh huh. Over the years, every form of human killing has found its place. I see. Ah. Because you get to revisit them all. Yeah, pretty lucky, aren't we? Oh, what? 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 Right. So, I'm really... Alright, it's not bad. Can we skip this? Yes, we can. Alright, so I'm guessing... We have to... Somehow... Get rid of all the gas. Which, you know, makes sense. Um. Ooh. Okay. Uh, nope, that's not what I wanted to do, is it? Right. Ooh, shove, 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 shove. There we go. Right. How much gas is left? So we've got that one. And I'm guessing... 
got that there. That's... Alright. So... Ooh! That was rough. Yeah, alright, dude. Spitting your stinky-ass gas breath at me. Um... Well, the good news is we're not exactly getting gassed anymore. Right, so there's a big ass boat here. Can't do anything with the boat though, can we? Must be something we can do with that boat. So that one's done. And I'm guessing, in theory, We should. Ah, okay, got ya. Got ya. I'm guessing. Ow. Oh, that's not an instant kill. Good to know. Right, let's deal with our stinky bastard little friend, shall we? I put myself in the chamber. But I didn't. Die. Right, where's he going? Exactly. You going over there? There we go. Ah, get a load of this. Oh, really? So we need to get him trapped in that area. Ow, oh, gas, stink. Stink. Too much stink. Alright. Um, this is going to require a little bit more. Hacked. We're just going to have to be quicker, I think. We don't have any weapon that can hurt him here, do we? Right, is he going over that? Yep. Damn it! Oh, you son of a fucking bitch. You're a penis. If only we could, like, remote activate that. Yeah, he just fucks off straight away. I'm guessing... There has to be... Something else. There has to be another way of blocking... That last vent. Uh-huh. I mean, I'm trying. Well, we could all do worse, friend. We could certainly all do worse. Oh! We got him? We got him? Yes? No? No? Can't tell whether we've actually got him or not. Oh! Yep. Now can we... There we go. Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I mean, sure. That works. Hermes. Alright. Yeah. Why not, eh? Actually, quite a fun little boss fight, that one. Not gonna, not gonna say it wasn't. Right, let's listen to Hermes. Hermes. I enjoyed that. Cataclysm, I have several times found myself mysteriously surrounded by noxious green fumes. I have fled in each case, and I think if I had not, I might not be alive to write this now. Within the gas, I have seen a humanoid who seemed to take great joy in the prospect of my death. Could this be Hermes, Abbott's resident executioner for several decades? If I recall, he took his own life in the gas chamber. Yeah, the gas chamber was supposed to be a pretty rough way of being uh, executed. In fact, um, I believe I read somewhere that uh, it, they used to recommend people that were being uh, executed that way, that they take deep deep breaths to make it pass as quick as possible. It's just like, hmm. Yeah. 
yeah, pretty pretty rough. That was that was really cool. That was a unique boss. Enjoyed that. Anyway, onwards and upwards, and a child shall lead them. Well, we're going to leave it here. The lighthouse. Let's just listen to this. We've obviously missed a few of these, sadly, but... The lighthouse. The lighthouse is the oldest standing structure on Carnate Island. Its cornerstone states its date of construction as 1834. The light was originally oil-powered, but since the 1950s has run off of a nearby generator. Similarly, the lighthouse's rotation was originally powered by a system of gears that would periodically need to be re-cranked. To this day, when the power goes off, the motion needs to be restarted by hand cranking. Oof. Damn. Well, I guess we're going to go to a very retro lighthouse. And I, for one, am looking forward to that adventure. Alas, that's going to have to wait for the next time. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.